Hi, I'm Amanda Gillen, Director of Learning at the Frick Pittsburgh. Today we are at West Overton Village in Scottsdale, PA, visiting the site and meeting with some of their staff. With me is Erin Hollis, one of the co-directors of West Overton, and we're excited to be here. Thank you for having us. Oh, it's our pleasure. We're glad you're here. Great. Can you tell me a little bit about what we're seeing and where we are today? Yeah, of course. So right now we're standing on the, the front porch of the Overholt Homestead. You know, we, we have a shared connection with Henry Clay Frick, and he was born here in the spring house on the property uh, in 1849. But where we are was the home place of his grandparents, Abraham and Mariah Overholtz. Throughout his life, Abraham oversaw a family transition, a, a unprecedented growth, turning his family farm into a village that grew around, of all things, a rye whiskey distillery. This site was preserved thanks to Henry Clay Frick's daughter, Helen Clay Frick, who op opened it as a museum in 1928. And now we're going on 96 years here as a museum. So your museum, our museum, and then the Frick Collection. I think it's interesting that this Frick story carries through from three different institutions. And I think we're probably one of the only historic families or, or sites that kind of have that kind of lineage. Yeah, we absolutely. We explore some more of the site together. Yeah. We are on the second floor of the museum building here at West Overton. It is a beautiful brand new space. Can you tell us about what we're seeing? Sure, the room that we're in right now is called the Sam Pumwanek Gallery. And in this room, we have on display 275 whiskey bottles from distilleries across Pennsylvania. All told in this room, we have about 450 objects that interpret this forgotten part of Pennsylvania's history. And we have now on display the largest collection of Pennsylvania whiskey history anywhere. We have another space to show you, and I am here with Patrick Bochy, who is the other co-executive director of West Overton Village. Patrick, thank you for welcoming me to the bar. Can you tell me about what we're doing here? Yeah, absolutely. So we're standing in what was a small pre-Civil War livestock barn that we then retrofitted into a small educational rye distillery. And I say educational distillery because that is the end goal, to educate folks and guests about the history of Pennsylvania whiskey. So with that being said, let's have a drink. Let's have a drink. much for joining us here at West Overton. We are actually doing a full day program on June 1st that will start at the Frick and come here. So we hope you join us and spend the day with us out here together.